To present the awards for the best documentary feature and short subject, here's a man twice nominated for best supporting actor and a young actress who appears in this year's Under Fire. They're also a father and daughter. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Jack Palance and Miss Holly Palance. Documentaries are a very special kind of filmmaking. Prove it. Come. Easily. The nominated pictures speak for themselves. For the best achievement in documentary short subjects, the nominees are Flamingo at 515, Cynthia Scott and Adam Szymanski producers. In the nuclear shadow, what can the children tell us? Vivian, Verdon Rowe, and Eric Thierman, producers. Sewing Woman, Arthur Dong, producer. Spaces. The Architecture of Paul Rudolph, Robert Eisenhardt, producer. You Are Free, B. Brockman and Eileen Landis, producers. And the winner is... Flamingo at 515, Cynthia Scott and Adam Szymanski, producers. artists contributed to this film, but we would like to thank particularly Paul Cowan, Hans Ooms, Paul Demers, and the wonderful dancers from the National Ballet School of Canada. But most importantly, I would like to thank the two great teachers of Flamenco at 515, Susanna and Antonio Robledo. It is their dignity, their discipline, and their commitment to life which were the inspiration for this film. Thank you. This film was produced by National Film Board of Canada. Uh, we're funded by the Canadian public, and so on behalf of our 25 million investors, I'd like to thank the Academy very much. I'm very proud. Thank you. Happy birthday, Jimmy. Leslie Ann, Jennifer, and Beth. Thanks. Good night, don't we? The nominated achievements in documentary features are Children of Darkness, Richard Kotak, and Ira Chekmayan, producers. First Contact, Bob Connolly and Robin Anderson, producers. He makes me feel like dancing. Emil Ardolino, producer. The Profession of Arms, War Series, Film 3. Michael Bryans and Tina Vilgen, producers. Seeing Red, James Klein and Julia Reichert, producers. And... Uh, I wonder if that means anything. No. The winner is He Makes Me Feel Like Dancing, Emil Ardolino, producer. harder to get up here than to make the film. Uh, what a feeling, indeed. Uh, uh, it's a very special moment and made more special by the fact that there are so many children here who are in the film to share it with me. I'd like to thank the members of the Academy, the superb co-producer Judy Kinberg, 
Executive producers, Edgar Sherrick, Scott Rudin, Sue Pollack, and I have to thank Lucy Johnson, who thought of the idea. NBC, brilliant film editors, Tom Haneke and Charlotte Grossman, cameraman Francis Kenny, Don Lenzer, and most of all, an extraordinary man, Jack Tamboise. man who really did take his passion and make it happen in his belief that the arts could transform people's lives and has obviously generated such positive energy and joy to thousands of people in New York City through the National Dance Institute. Thank you very, very much. <laughs>